Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anil and uh, in this Vue.js 3D tutorial, we will learn about routing. So these are the six steps that we will be follow in this video. First of all, we will learn what is routing and why we use it. After that, we will install routing package. Uh, we will make a routing configuration file. After that, we will define routes and make links for route. And at the last, this example will be completed and we will discuss some interview questions related to routing at a basic level right because uh, two or three more videos we will be make on routing like four or four page how we can pass the parameters and all but uh, basic things about routing will be completed in this video so first question is why we use routing uh, so in many website you may see that uh, we have basic pages like a home page profile page login page contact us and about us page etc right so in single page application like Vue.js or angular or react we cannot use directly anchor tag because it will reload your pages right so that we have to use this routing uh, package and uh, it will define the different different package without reloading right so uh, we need to install this package so first of all I'm just going to jump on command line and we will stop it and simply write here npm i or npm install view hyphen router at the rate next it will be install your latest package and within that time we can make our configuration file also but yeah uh, we are going to define three routes for uh, in this uh, video one is home page another is login page second third one is profile page so we need three components but for now we have only one component which is home so i am going to make uh, two more pages uh, like profile dot view and after that let me make a uh, login dot view you can put any name to these this is not mandatory that you have to put only login you can even put here sign in page also whatever you want right and we don't need footer in this so i am going to remove it because it may confuse you so to make it very quickly what we need to do let's copy and paste this code or uh, i can just remove this code also i don't need this code right sorry for that because this code is belong to the last video and uh, we can copy and paste here and let's change the name like uh, login page and define name like uh, login and same thing we can do with the profile mm -hmm. profile page and let's put here uh, profile here perfect so and i need to fix this one also so now we have three pages that's fine and uh, now we want to convert these three pages to routes right and our package is also installed here you can see that this is installed uh, and with the zero vulnerabilities that means good so now let's go to the route of src folder and let's make your configuration file even you can make this configuration file anywhere in your project but uh, i will prefer in a simple project you can make it on a uh, src folder so just simply put here uh, routes routes dot js keep in mind this file should not be like uh, uh, routes dot view it should be like route dot js that js extension must be that and now let's import something from uh, view router and we have to import two things uh one is uh, basically uh, router web history or uh, something sorry which is uh, create web history right so that uh, every route can make a history also in browser and after that create router and uh, now we have to import our uh, components so let's say import home from components home dot view similarly let's import three more second and third one for uh, profile and login and let's change the respectively name also profile and uh, 
login fine now what we can do here let's make a const and uh, define routes and uh, it can be make uh, objects inside it every route have its own object and it have three properties path uh, for the component path uh, sorry for route path name for component and component on which component on which path we want to load so let's say my uh, mm, route name is home here first of all uh, which is let's say home my bad on which path we want to open this uh, route on slash and that means it will open on a root path so it can be like a home also but we did not like show this but we can show like about and all but uh, we are making home route here so we can just make it blank or you can say that root uh, path and after that a component which component we want to load on here so one we want to load profile login or home obviously home so let's define here home and with a similar way we have to define two more routes uh, one for login and uh, here we will load our uh, login component and path can be like login and after that profile uh, sorry for spell and again profile and uh, component will name will be again profile so that's fine now we have to uh, create the web history and create route so let's take a const here and take, make a route and here create route is a function basically and it will accept two parameters within a, sorry it will accept a object as a parameter and it have history and a history can be like a create web history and this is again a function after that uh, we can define here routes right uh, we are just uh, registering this routes constant as a uh, second key that's fine and now we need to export it so we can just simply put here export default router that's fine uh, work for this file has been completed now so now what we can do here now we can register this file inside our main so let's import it here import uh, routers uh, from routes and here we can use a uh, dot use and uh, sorry this is not use context this is simply use sometime autocomplete may glitch and here we can register our routes that's fine router has been registered so now we can just start it with the npm run serve and we can check everything is working fine uh, but this that uh, still uh, routing is not completed there is some few points are still remaining i will show you but first of all let's check the output everything is fine in a routes.js file or there is something missing right so yes first thing is we should not to use here semicolon we can use here comma because it's showing the readme here so i guess that okay use context is not defined so where i use use context maybe this is imported by mistakely uh, that one right so i can remove it and now we can reload it but now you can see that routing is here this is by default uh, uh, like routing is not working there is a no links and all uh, and if you are guessing that that you are right because this content is still coming from uh, app.view here you can see that we have a home page and all so if i remove it from home page then you will find that there is a no routing and all there is only uh, let me just take it home and uh, yep i have to compile it again 
yep uh, because i have to remove this component registry and this because i just removed the home component from here and now you will file that find that only uh, image is here right which is coming from default image so if i just remove here and put here h1 tag uh, like um, app component then you will find that we are right so this is not coming from route so what we can do here for that to show the routings what we need to do we have to use here router view right and we need to close it also so is it working with that way also so let me check yes this is working so if i am just jumping on a login login page is here if i just jump on a profile profile page is here but how we can make links here and uh, first thing is which is very important i have to remove this routing and putting here home page so let me go on there and just put here home page right and now how we can define these routes here or uh, uh, everything is defined but how we can define the links for uh, these uh, routes for that just simply go again on app.view and simply mention here router link router link and let's close it also and uh, just define here home page so let me see what is we are showing here so let me refresh it nothing is working maybe we maybe miss something which is path and we can path here for slash because this this is the home page path right and uh, again let's refresh again we miss something mm, i think i already provided that but uh, let me check again okay so sorry so i i just need to put here to not path and uh, now this is working fine for home page so we can define this three link also like uh, mm -mm, login page profile page and here you can define login we have to just uh match this to with path right so if you mismatch it the route will not gonna open and now let's see home page profile page login page everything is working fine but let's make a blind break with that right br and here we go now this is much better so in next video we will learn that how we can pass parameters uh, like here we can pass here like name id and all and uh, after that we will also learn that how we can show the 404 page and kind of things so thanks for watching this video don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video